Hello and good evening. Welcome to another installment to our series, Live from St. Mark's. I'm Stephen Kane, and I'm the General Manager of the Omni Foundation for the Performing Arts. We'd like to give a special thanks to our series sponsors, the Hill Guitar Company, Guitar Salon International, the Diodario Foundation, Guitar Solo, and the San Francisco Grants for the Arts. You can find tickets and information about our upcoming concert season at omniconcerts.com. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Tonight's artist is a friend and colleague whose playing I've been a fan of for many years. Whenever he plays, I'm always left with wanting more. A truly inspirational guitarist in every sense. And we're finally thrilled to have him here on an Omni event. He has recently released a lot of incredible material on his own YouTube channel, which I encourage you to check out and subscribe to. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce Alec Holcomb.
break after that one. Um, also, I have to tune my strings down. This next piece is a, uh, it's a cello piece, and I have to take a few minutes because uh, these go pretty low here. One second. I'll just go, it'll stretch up otherwise. Anyway, um, while I'm waiting for these to stretch, I just wanted to thank everybody for being here. I think uh, originally this idea was to uh, just have the cameras here, but uh, through quite a bit of effort uh, on Richard's part, I think that this happened and it's much nicer to play for people, for listeners rather than cameras. Um, so thank you for that. I also wanted to thank Richard and the Omni Foundation and uh, of course Matt here for doing all the camera work, Stephen for getting me here and doing all this other administrative stuff and for his very kind intro. stretch after all that, but that's actually the reason I'm not playing the second movement of this piece, is because I'd have to tune back up and then back down. These are details y'all don't need to know, but uh, here we go.
All right, it won't take too long to tune these back up, I don't think. So uh, I come from a long line of guitar players. Uh, I'm actually not sure beyond my grandfather, but I know my grandfather played guitar, my dad played guitar, and uh, my grandfather really loved bluegrass, uh, as did that whole side of the family because they lived out in uh, West Virginia and that's just kind of music they played so my grandfather got pretty good at it and uh, he loved a lot of Chet Atkins music and Jerry Reed music so I thought I'd learn a, uh, a little bluegrass tune. This is uh, The Claw by Jerry Reed. And while these still stretch, uh, it's called The Claw because Jerry Reed's picking style kind of resembled The Claw. Uh, like that somehow. I think he only plucked with these three fingers. Uh, I have to double check on that, but uh, it's a very classical technique actually, and it turns out that it translates well to the classical guitar. So, all right, we're good now. Here's the claw. Second tune. Everybody's got the time. <laughs> 